morning, TL Travelers, and welcome to, or welcome back to the TL Travel YouTube channel. Today, we are traveling to Ontario. It is hella early right now. Um, we just got to the airport. It is, what time is it? Oh, it is 5.14 a.m. And yeah, we've got like a pretty big travel day ahead of us because we are not just going to Toronto. Um, we're flying into Toronto and then we are trying to figure out the go system so that we can get ourselves to Oshawa, then get picked up in Oshawa and head out to a cottage country because we figure it's just this time around we're gonna skip the city altogether and uh, yeah, just lake life it up. So wish us luck today. If you are feeling the cottage vibes, hit that like button if you think that we can make it hit that like button and hit that subscribe button and we will just get this day started. So I'll give you the whole review a little bit later, but for now we have to go and figure out where to catch the train to Union Station to then get us to Oshawa, which is something we've never done before. So we'll let you know how that goes. So you want to follow the signs for trains to Terminal 1 when you first get to the airport, if you're not in Terminal 1, and that will also take you to the trains into the city. One that just says like I'll show go. Yeah, just do that. That's not going on. No. I'll show and go. Yeah. Oh my goodness, I needed this so bad. <laughs> Alex just flying around up there on his hoverboard. Oh. Hi, 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 Who are you? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, family. <laughs> Uh, I'll grab the, uh, there's a couple. Yeah, there's another one for you in there. Oh my gosh, we made it. I am, oh. That was a long day. I will say that taking the UPE from Pearson and then taking the go to Oshawa is super convenient and like price-wise definitely makes sense. Um, I would not recommend it at rush hour <laughs> because just, I mean, what do you recommend that rush hour? So I am gonna give you guys really quickly just a little rundown of how to use the public transit and go from Union Station to Oshawa because it's not just one train service. So it's not as simple as just getting on the train and taking it as far as Oshawa. You do have to change at Union Station and it is not go all the way. So as I mentioned earlier, when you arrive at Pearson Airport, you do need to get to Terminal 1 to catch the onward train or the UP or Union Pearson Express to Union Station. The ticket for one person on the UP to Union was I believe 12 
50 or 12.25. Um, so definitely cheaper than like an Uber or anything else like that. So totally worth it. And there is, because it is like an airport express specifically, there is space for your luggage and things like that. So you can put your luggage up on a luggage shelf and then grab a seat and you don't have to worry about taking up seats with luggage. However, that said, when you get to Union and you get on the go to Oshawa, there are not um, storage, like luggage storage, because it's not um, like an airport express. Not, not from what we saw anyways. So the cart that we were on did not have any storage for luggage. So we were traveling with two checked bags. So we got our ticket from Union Station to the GO station in Oshawa. That ticket was also $12. So it ends up being about $25 per person for the whole journey from Union Pearson to Oshawa. Um, and yeah, like I was saying, we didn't see any spots for luggage or anything like that. So during rush hour, if you have checked bags and things like that, and you're getting on the GO train, um, you do sort of have to like maneuver around people and find space to put your bags, which I imagine can be slightly frustrating <laughs> for regular commuters. Um, we lucked out the upstairs portion of the train didn't have that many people on it. So we were able to find um, like a set of four seats that were totally empty that we could put all of our bags in and it wasn't like a big deal, but that's just something to keep in mind. The UP Express from Pearson Airport to uh, Union Station comes every 15 minutes and it was 25 minute drive. And then the train, the GO train from Union Pearson to uh, Oshawa is every 30 minutes according to the schedule that we saw and it takes about an hour and five minutes so all in all it took us just under two hours to get from the airport after picking up of our checked baggage to Oshawa oh sorry oh no worries <laughs> oh hi Stella just bringing her in that's hey. right. yeah that's totally like fine work. and then as you saw um we met up with my parents and it was another hour and a half to two hours to get here where we are now but all that said would I recommend it for one person definitely worth it for two people again definitely worth it you just want to make sure that you're not arriving at rush hour and then I believe for three people it would have made more sense to just get an uber but um yeah that's my whole review and I hope that that helped you guys out a little bit. Now we are here in the Kawartha Lakes just like kicking back love and life so I am so excited to just like do a little bit of adventuring around Ontario, check out the lakes and then of course we will be road tripping back from Ontario to Alberta. There's going to be lots of fun beautiful scenery to share for you there as well so if you've not already hit that subscribe button definitely do it because we post new travel content every Thursday and Sunday and until I see you next stay great travel safe and uh love that cottage life. <laughs> Bye guys.